Hello, it's Dvina from UsefulGraphicDesignTutorials.com. Today I'm going to show you a very quick way of removing this white background from these books. If you would like to learn how to use GIMP for other projects with your images, just click on the link below the video. The first thing to do is to bring an image into GIMP and when you've opened up GIMP you will get the central working area. You may not have the toolbox or layers and I don't have layers at the moment so to bring them in you would go to Windows and click on Dockable Dialog Boxes and come down to Layers or Control L. Move that out of the way there. Similarly, Control 8 or go into Windows and Toolbox and click on that and it will bring it up. Because without the toolbox, you can't do anything. We'll now bring in the image. So it's File, Open and go to any, wherever on your computer the image you want. I'm not going to bring it in because it's already there and I will cancel it. And what we're going to do is to remove this white. It's so much easier to remove a plain single colour than it would be to do all this. And what we're going to remove it with is the fuzzy select tool. So click on there and you'll see that it's highlighted so it's in use. Come over to the image and click on there and you can see the marching ants all the way around the top. I want to get rid of this little bit so if you hold the shift key down a plus sign happens and click on there. To make sure that you get all the white out I would then go up to select and come down to grow and I'm going to grow the pixels by two one in fact click OK and what in fact that's done is push the selection into the image by two pixels. So we have selected the white and now what we're going to do is delete it. And you'll see it's been deleted because you now have the checkerboard which indicates a transparent layer. A quick way to check that it's transparent. I've opened a new document and it's bright yellow but to have the highlight the layer from here and click and drag it over and you'll see it's come onto the yellow. If we hadn't removed the white background that would have been white. OK, so you've now got your image without its white background and you need to save it. So I'm going to go up to File, Save As and PN, .png. That's very important to preserve the transparency. And click and save. And I will replace that one. Don't alter any of these, just click save. And your image is saved. As I say, that's a quick way of removing the white background. I hope to meet you again in further tutorials. That's all for now. Bye bye.